What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu walkthrough. Okay, so we're finally here in Pallet Town. Uh, not for a visit, but we are going to go to Viridian City because, yeah, one more badge awaits us and all that stuff. And, uh, well, this brings back memories, you know, being back after a long time. Hopefully we don't run into some kind of effed up Pokemon and all that stuff. Let's see, I believe we can actually find items right here. Or oh, we already did. I don't know. Talk to this guy. Yes, he will give us a potion afterwards. I don't know why I'm checking him. Uh, it's just a it's just a force of habit and all that stuff. But as you can see right here, you will be finding some Pokemon that you've seen before. And here we are, finally back into Viridian City. Now, is there is something? Yeah, there is. I think I've already been to him before. Now. Before we do anything, I gotta heal up my Pokemon because in the last episode we went through a whole bunch of water type trainers and yeah, they were not that easy. Well, they were easy, but it's just they were not they were not pushovers and all that stuff. So here we go, healing up our Pokemon and uh, well, look at that. They are now okay. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and move on right here and see what else we can actually do. So let's see. We've already taken care of everything. The next thing we need to do is just one more thing, and that is a gym badge. And when we started this whole game off, of course, the gym was closed until this happened. Look at this, Trace. Huh. Why is the door locked? Open sesame. Dot, dot, dot. Huh. Yeah, I guess it was, it was, or that isn't going to work. Man. Oh, hey, Draven. Sheesh, say something if you're standing there, watching me act all embarrassing like that. Well, never mind that. So, how many badges have you got these days? S seven? Then it looks like we're even. All that's left for you now is the Radiant City Gym. Same for you, right? But this place is never open. I guess we've got to tell someone that we haven't uh, been... or so Tell someone that we haven't been able to get to the gym. But who should we talk to? Hmm. I'm probably guessing the old man there. And he's like, what, me? I don't know anything about the thing like that. Oh, of course you wouldn't. Sorry about that. Well, think, ourselves, think it over ourselves. How about Sparky? Is Sparky's all like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dot, dot, dot. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Makes sense. If I could understand anything you said, this thing is getting us nowhere. So I guess we have to go straight to Professor Oak, and he's like, Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Let's go see if he knows anything. So here we are back to Pallet Town, and here's Professor Oak with his, uh, with his nephew. Oh, if it isn't Draven and Trace. You two are both looking more grown up than the last time I saw you. And you have impeccable timing as usual. Let me introduce you. This is my grandson. Um, what was his name now again? Wow. Gramps, no one ever laughs at that joke. Would you give it, uh, give it a break? And besides, we've already met. My own grandson, you're no fun. Yeah, yeah, sure, Gramps. More important than that, though. Draven, Trace, you two did awesome. Huh? With Team Rocket, I never thought that the, their boss would actually be holed up in there in their at Silco. And the two of you managed to take him down. Dot, dot, dot. No, it wasn't me. Draven beat Giovanni all by himself. All I did was help a bit. Kinda. So what? You and your Pokemon did, be did your best too, right, Trace? So I've got a little something for you two as a reward for your hard work. We get ourselves a keystone. Holy crap. Okay, so a keystone. Ooh, isn't that a keystone? A stone that can trigger an evolution that transcends all evolutions? Mega evolution? Mega evolution? What's that? If you have both a Keystone and a and the right Mega Stone, you can make your Pokemon Mega Evolve in battle. Just one time per battle, though. Your Pokemon will get all powered up to battle hard for you. Mega Evolution is proof of the strong bond between a Pokemon and its trainer. Mm -hmm. A brief poem, if I may. When two suits are held, two stones are held. When two hearts become as one, we Mega Evolve. Okay, so that was uh, odd. The two of you should be able to use these as well. These are Mega Stones. And look at that. I got all the starters Mega Stones right here. 
You're going to take on the Pokemon League, aren't you? Give these a try, to, uh, too. Alrighty, so... We got ourselves Mega Stones. I think we're ready to kick some ass, take some names. I think I have three Pokemon ready to use those Mega Stones right here, too. And when that happens, look at this. Pikachu's looking, and he's like... Hmm. Oh, wow, he's... He's looking at something right here. Oh, if it isn't Pikachu! Look at her. You want to know what I'm doing? I'm picking flowers. I'm going to uh, make a bouquet for someone very important. But it's a secret. You don't tell anyone, right, Draven? Oh, that's right. Um, The Viridian City Gym Leader came back to the gym at last. That's what people are saying. You should head off to Viridian City. And what is Pikachu doing right here? Holy crud, what is going on right now? Okay, so... That is cool, that is cool. Okay, so, um... Okay, so we can go back to the Pokemon Gym, and, well, that is exactly what I'm gonna ask Pikachu to do right here. I'm gonna ask him to... Look at that, he's all happy and stuff. Alright, so we're gonna use this secret technique, because we need to get to Viridian City without getting attacked by any of these Pokemon. And, well, there it is. Let's go ahead and fly. Alrighty, so we're using our magic scooter. And, well, here we are back in Viridian City, and, well, what really excites me about this whole thing right here is that now I can use Mega Evolution, and, oh, man, you know what? I'm going to do it anyways. I am going to, uh, hold on just a sec. I got three Pokemon that now can Mega Evolve, so I'm going to showcase that by, let's see, we're going to take out Dragonite for the time being. Mew de Uno and Sandslash and yes we're gonna actually finally put Godzilla back into the party right here and Dubasaur alrighty and let's see we got one two three oh we can okay so never mind we can actually add one more Pokemon into this party right here so well, I guess we could put in uh, let's see a little bit of a mixture of both teams right here we got three and three hold on let's see we got one right here, two. Okay, so let's see. Hmm. Let's go with Hydra. Alrighty, so Hydra is in the team. It is time. It is go time right here. And I don't think Pikachu is going to be doing anything right here, so look at this. It's looking all mysterious. And way up in the back, we can't see who the gym leader is, but look at this guy. Yo, champion of making. Even I don't know who the Viridian City gym leader is. But the one thing's certain. You're qualified to challenge the gym leader because you have seven badges. This gym leader will be stronger than any Pokemon trainers you've ever faced. As also, I heard uh, that uh, these are ground type users. Okay. Alrighty, so... In this gym battle right here, we're not going to... I don't think we're going to be using Pikachu at all. So he's going to be taking a back seat. We're going to start Mega Evolving Pokemon here and there. So we're going to start off with Leonardo. Then uh, work our way to Godzilla. Godzilla, because it's been a while. So... Oh, crud. Really? Well, I kind of screwed myself right there a little bit. Not so much. Okay, so bring it on. The Viridian City Gym was closed for a long time, but now our gym leader is back. Okay, alrighty, so here we go. First battle in the 8th Gym Badge, Ace Trainer Samuel, and he will be coming out with his Nido King. Look at this guy. Alright, Leonardo, it is time. Okay. And now that you can Mega Evolve, you do have the option right there on the corner. We're going to choose this and get ourselves... A surf attack right here, and here it is. It is reacting to the Mega Stone. Oh, yeah. Mega Blastoise. Alrighty. So here we go. Getting some right now. Surf attack for the win. Look at Mega Blastoise. What now? Look at that. <laughs> it's a one and done kind of deal, guys, but we still get the job done right here. And he was beaten. Yes, you were. Okay, so that's one done. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon now. So that's one guy. Let's go straight to Dubasaur. Now, Dubasaur happens to be our weakest Pokemon right here. So 
Excuse me while I'm doing this, but I kind of need to toughen it up a little. So let's go ahead and give it up to level 40 so it can have a fighting chance right here. All right. Let's see where we can go. Uh, now we're going to have to go right here. We have to battle everybody. And I kind of don't want to skip anybody right here. So here he is looking at us. Your Pokemon will cower at the crack of my whip. Yeah, don't say. Alright, here we go. Going up against Tamer Cole, and he does have two Pokemon, of course. He's gonna come out with his Nidorino right here. Alright, Dubasaur. Let's get this. And, well... Let's get it. Mega Evolution for the win! Alrighty. Another Mega Evolution. Look at that. Mega Venusaur. Okay, and here we go with a takedown attack. And that takes a little bit of damage, but here we have Poison Jab. Not going to be super effective against us. So now, I'm going to try this again. Let's go. Alright, we definitely need a better move for, for Mega, uh, Mega Dubasaur right here. And uh, Crud. Alright, let's go. Let's finish this guy off. Oh, crap, Baskets! Well, that wasn't the... Okay. Come on, let's go for a takedown. Come on. Does it. And say goodbye to Nidorino. And Dubasaur gets hit with a recoil right here. And Godzilla grows to level 66. And let's see, he's about to use Rhyhorn. I'm going to stay put right here. I'm kind of hoping that we're faster than Rhyhorn so we could use a Mega Drain. So let's go right ahead. And yes, we are faster. Look at that. Finishes off Rhyhorn. Super Saiyan Mega Dubasaur. Look at that. Oh, yeah. What now? What now? Alrighty, so Tamer Cole has been defeated. I'm feeling good about this one right here. So that's another person down through Mega Evolution. And, well. Let's see, let's move this right here. Time for Godzilla, Godzilla, mainly because it has two Mega Evolutions. Mega Charizard Y, X, and Y. And this one's going to be an interesting one right here. So, here we go. Let's bring it out. And let's go, here we go. You are challenged by Ace Trainer Kelly, and she is coming out with her Nido Queen. What moves do I have for my Godzilla? I haven't used this guy in quite some time, and this guy is looking all mean and everything. No worries. I got the trick for this guy right here. Let's see. X or Y. Let's go with Y. Let's go. Solar Beam Attack. Oh, yes. Look at this. Look at this. Mega Charizard Y. Now it's an actual Dragon-type Pokemon, and... Well, normally... It would have a drought. It would have a drought move, and it would actually just use its. Uh, it would actually use its what you call it. It's its solar beam every single time. But since in this game there is no such thing as effects or anything, here we are. Solar beam attack. Oh yes, for the win, Mega Charizard Y. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. And Hydra's growing to levels too. And there goes Kelly. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so that was that right there. I'm actually going to be switching out for the time being. We can, we're going to save that last evolution for later. Now it's time for Hydra to get some right here. And, well, we're going to be battling some Pokemon trainers here and there. So let's go right ahead and say goodbye to the gym leader right here. And, wow. This is taking us to this guy right here. Huh. You must be running out of steam by now. Not really. I'm only getting started. So, let's go right ahead and battle ourselves, Doug Trio. And look at that. I got myself my gut or my, uh, whatchamacallit, my Hydra right here. Alrighty. Maximum effort, Waterfall. Oh, crud. Here we go. Waterfall does it. There we go. Look at that. Okay, we're kicking ass right now with a Hydra right here. I guess we could use all our Pokemon right here. So here we go again. 
Another uh, Rhyhorn. So let's go right ahead and finish this guy off. Waterfall for the win. Look at this. We're just going up into Waterfall and just destroying this guy. So there goes Rhyhorn. And there is a Victory Forest right there. All out of gas. Okay. Alrighty. So that was uh, all our Pokemon right there. I'm actually going to be switching up some Pokemon right now. Let's use every single one of these guys that we actually had. So, let's see. I think we've already used Ultra Psycho at one point. So, let's go ahead and switch out... Let's switch out Dubasaur since, you know... We've already uh, used his Mega Evolution form. Let's bring back Thrasher to the fold right here. And... We've already used these two guys right here. It's not going to be fair. It's only fair if we use Budkiss one last time, so let's go right ahead and put him... Eh, let's put him where Hydra's at. And just for safe measure, let's go ahead and give him a Meg... Or, uh, let's give him a... Let's see. First, let's give him a Growlithe Candy. There we go, he's getting stronger. And what else? A Rare Candy. There you go, he's at level 40. And... Well, hopefully we can actually do something with this guy. So here we have an item, and look at that. The only item you'll ever find in, in, in a gym anywhere. And now it's time for us to take us to this location. Let's see. Where are we going? Uh, okay, so let's see. There, up there. How about here? There we go. Okay, so... Let's go ahead and fight the Karate Guy first. I'm the Karate King. Your fate rests with me. Alrighty, let's go right ahead and take on another Karate King. His name is Takashi, also known as TK, or DK, Donkey Kong. And here he comes out with a Graveler, and oh crud. Okay, so we're at a huge disadvantage, but no biggie. Yeah, there's a biggie. Okay, never mind. What was the, what was the whole idea of bringing out, uh, bringing out, uh, what's his name? I don't know. Let's just move on. Here we are, switching it up to Smasher. Alrighty. Let's get Smasher here, and here comes an Earthquake. I think, no, that's probably a Magnitude, probably. I don't know. I haven't even read it. So, let's go with a Drill Run. Finish this guy off right here. Bam! For the win. No more Graveler. Okay, alrighty, alrighty. We're doing some uh, justice right there, and Takashi has been defeated. All right, let's be, let's let's go ahead and take on this guy. Pokemon, Pokemon, and I, we make wonderful music together. He does. We do. I don't know. So, let's go right ahead. Take on Tamer Jason coming out with his Sand Slash. Unfortunately, it's not the same Sand Slash that we had. So here we go. Sand Slash, getting ready attack right here and well let's go right ahead and go with an outrage see with it how, how that helps us so let's go outrage takes a nice chunk and it doesn't really do much we're gonna miss so we're probably gonna have to switch out our Pokemon right now crud baskets okay and here comes a dig attack oh gravy okay so that right there is no good so let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here let's go straight to Leonardo and you know what? I'm going to be very, very petty because I kind of feel like I need to. Let's go right ahead and, uh, well, take a slash attack right here. All right. Maximum effort. Let's go Mega Evolution. Surf attack right here. Yes, I'm going to be very petty right now. So there we go. Mega evolving for the second time right here. Look at that. And we're, oh, wow. Seriously? protecting yourself okay that's a good strategy right there but guess what this is going to happen and it's going to hurt right here get this surf attack and there we go Saint slash has been defeated there we go buckus look at that and thrasher grows level 65 you are in perfect harmony yes I am okay so that is that. We got one more trader to go. I guess I should be switching out Pokemon right here. So let's go ahead and bring back this guy. And 
No, actually, I should have probably, uh, hold on. Hold on, let's take this guy out. And let's put this guy in right here. Actually, you know what? We've already used Leonardo quite a few times, so let's go right ahead and screw with this uh, next trainer right here. Let's just put this guy in here. And, yep, we got a good team right now. We are keeping Godzilla for one good reason and, good, and a very good reason right here, and that is to finally Mega Evolve into Charizard X. So, let's see. We're going to start off with... We're going to start off with Thrasher right here. So let's go right ahead and take on the last gym leader. We're going to give it everything we got into this one. All right. What's up, homeboy? Oh, wow. He's looking all pimpy and all that stuff. Look at this guy. Wow. <laughs> Welcome to my hideout. It shall be... It shall be so until I can restore Team Rocket to its former glory. Yeah, got you guys had glory? But you have done found me again, so be it. This time, I'm not holding anything back. Once more then, you shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Okay, so here it is, guys. The final gym battle against gym leader Giovanni. Team Rocket's leader as well. And he's got himself four Pokemon... So we gonna we're gonna use everything we got right here. Alrighty, so here it is, debuting for the first time, a Thrasher. And look at that, he's already got Earthquake Attack right here, and crap, this guy's already beating us to the punch right here. Holy crud, okay, so let's go with an Earthquake Attack right here. Earthquake Attack does the trick, say goodbye to Doug Drio. Alrighty. And, well, let's see, what is he going to come out with? He's going to come out with a Nido Queen. So, let's go right ahead and use our good old buddy Ultra Psycho right here. Let's get it. Alrighty. What's up, Ultra Psycho? Meet Giovanni. I think you've already beaten him one time. And look at that. Okay, so here we go. Let's go for the Psychic Attack right here. Yeah, buddy. Oh, yeah, this is automatic cheat codes right here. Oh, yeah. Say goodbye to... Say goodbye to Needle Queen. And here he comes out with a Needle King. So, let's go for another Pokemon right here. Let's go for Sparky. He hasn't had any battles right here. It's only fair that we just beat this Needle King with a smaller Pokemon in it. Look at this guy. Alrighty. Let's go. So let's get this with the Splishy Splash attack. Yes, you're going to get beat by a really goofy name. Look at that. And Needle King is just uh, using Earthquake. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Almost beat Sparky. May I remind you guys that Sparky in this game, undefeated, cannot let it lose right here. And look at that. Needle King has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so we got one more Pokemon to actually battle, and it is Rhydon. I know it's a disadvantage, but we're going to go straight for it. Let's go. Let's get it. It may be a two-turn thing, but guess what? I don't care. Let's go up against Rhydon. Godzilla, Godzilla, ready to kick butt right here. Take names. Let's go. Charizard X right here. Actually, let's go for a Brick Break. It's a Rock-type Pokemon. So here we go, another big evolution, this time going into Charizard X. Look at this guy. Kind of reminds you of my Pokemon X walkthrough. And look at that, right on using Rock Slide right here. Oh crud, quadruple damage. Alright, we got one more chance to beat this guy, so let's go right ahead. Brick Break, bam, for the win. And there we go, we're getting boosted and... Pet, pet. That was a truly intense fight! Yes. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And he is happy. Yet again, I am defeated. As proof of your victory, here is your Earth Badge. That's right, throwing out that peace sign. Give me some fives. Look at that. Got the Earth Badge. An Earth Badge makes all Pokemon obey you, regardless of how high their level is or who originally caught them. It is proof of your mastery as a Pokemon trainer with the... With it, you can challenge the Pokemon League and this TM. 
a gift for a trainer who dares to take on the challenge of the Pokemon League. We get ourselves the TM41 Earthquake. TM41 Earthquake, it's a powerful attack that causes a massive tremor to deal damage to its opponents. I made it a very long time ago, back when I ran this gym far too long ago. I can't face my followers after being defeated like this. Team Rocket is... As of today, Team Rocket is finished. Oh, damn. Very, very harsh. As for myself, I shall dedicate my life to Pokemon training again. Oh, damn. Let us meet again someday. Farewell. Well, that is that. And, uh, yeah, look at this. Gym Leader Draven, right? Game of Thrones style. What's up, Pikachu? What do you have to say? That's right, buddy. Who's the man? We're the man. That's right. We're gonna we're gonna give you a a nice. There we go. Belly rub. That's right. Look at that. And there we go. Okay. So that is that, guys. We got all eight badges, and well, we're just not going anywhere right here now. Something does happen after you defeat the gym leader right here, and that is that I believe Gary or Blue comes out, and he assumes the, the well, he basically assumes the quote-unquote throne right here. So look at that. Eight badges in all, and, well, let's see what happens. Oh, look at that. Blue is right here. Congrats, kid. Boy, though, what a shock. I never thought a criminal would use a, gym, a Pokemon gym as their hideout. That's it. I've decided. I'll look after the Viridian Gym from now on. I don't really like to get tied down, so I've always said no when they ask about it. But I fi I'm finally ready. I'll be the gym leader from now on. Alright, let's go ahead and battle. Huh? I mean, sure, but I think you've got a bigger chance to face right now. So then, Draven, time for you to take on the Pokemon 4. Or Pokemon League. Just keep going along Route 22 to the west of here, and you won't miss it. The Elite Four are tough opponents, but... You don't you dare lose. Well. Yeah. Of course, he's like, first challenger all half here. I'm sure it's going to be Trace. I'm going to show that little upstart how it's done. Wow. You know what? Go kick his ass. Really, kick his ass. Thinks he's uh, all that great and all that crud. So, yeah, guys. Eight badges in all. We used every single one of our Pokemon that we've had in our arsenal right here. That we've, you know, kept close. So, now... It is finally time for us to actually just uh, relax, capture some Pokemon off-screen, level my my, my my original team up. That way we can be better prepared against the Elite Four. And, uh, well, I, I don't know what else to say, guys. It's it's finally here. We're finally about to go to, to the Pokemon League and beat this game right here. So, let's see. I don't know what else I could do. Hmm. I don't know what else to do. Actually, you know what? Let's go right ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon and battle our good old buddy one last time before we actually get into the Pokemon League. It's only fair. It's only fair that we kicked his ass and show him who, who who the real boss is around here. So let's go with Sand Slash right here. And who else is missing? Ah, oh, here we go. Leonardo, you need some uh, more leveling up. Even though I would like to use my team, my original team that I went for the original run right here. I, you know, I got to stay true with the team that I have right now that I built up for this one. So let's go right ahead and challenge the good old buddy, the old uh, rival right here. And as soon as you're getting over here, you're going to get stopped. And Trace is going to be like, Draven! Hmm. I finally caught up to you. I got an Earth Badge too. That means we can finally get into the Pokemon League. I heard the Elite Four are incredibly strong, but there's no turning back now, right? You think you're ready, Draven? Show me your Pokemon you've raised. So here it is, guys. Our final battle before we go into the Pokemon League, and it's against our good old buddy, Trace. Of course, he's going to be starting off with the Pidgeot. You know what's ridiculous? Our final battle against this guy. It's going to be funny, guys. It's going to be really, really funny. So don't, don't try and uh, watch it on the other videos. It's going to be a spoiler. So there we go, Ice Punch, and this guy is going to try and blind us right here. Like, seriously, what, what, what are you trying to do here, man? Trying to blind me? So here we go. Miss, and let's go again with another Ice Punch. And this guy, of course, going with another Sand Attack. You are a dick for doing that. Seriously? 
Okay, here we go. Ice Punch for the win. Suck it, Pidgeot. Alrighty, okay. So there's that, and well, let's see. He's going to be coming out with a Jolteon, so let's go with Smasher right here. Alrighty. Let's go. What's up? How you doing there? We're going up against uh, a good old buddy Jolteon right here, and well, let's see. I think we got a... Uh, Let's see, we could go with Drill Run right here. Now, eventually, I'm going to teach my uh, Smasher, what was it, Earthquake Attack. So here we go, Drill Run. That looks painful. Super painful right there. And that right there takes care of that little situation. And now, we're going to go up against a Vileplume. So let's go straight to the man that helped us get here, and that is Dragonite. Alrighty. Let's go, Dragonite. You got this, Dragonite. We're gonna get this, Dragonite. Ready. Let's go right ahead and uh, take care of this Vileplume with a Flamethrower right here. Yeah, buddy. Flamethrower does its trick. Nearly does its trick. It, this Vileplume right here it gets burnt. Alrighty. And yes, we get a little too much love. That's right. We It misses, so we're gonna hit him one more time with a Flamethrower. Here we go, flamethrower for the win. Yeah, buddy, this guy has no chance. Man, if you're gonna be the champ, you gotta work your you gotta work your hardest right here. Alrighty, so he's coming out with Marowak. Time to show this guy what I'm all about. Let's go with Leonardo. Now, could be mistaken, the Cubone that was a uh, they kind of missed his mom. I'm pretty sure that it's this Marowak right here. Comment down below if that's true. And here it is, Marowak, looking pretty beefy and all that stuff, but guess what? I got Mega Evolution. Let's surprise this guy just a little bit. Oh, there we go. Mega Evolution. And here we go with a Surf Attack. Surf Attack does its trick. Say goodbye to Marowak. Look at that, look at that. Say goodbye, and Leonardo grows a level 56. Oh yes, oh yeah, look at that. And Smasher grows a level 57. And that's how you beat your rival right there. He's just like amazed, he's like, what the hell? That's right. You know, Draven, I've always felt like I needed to look after you, ever since we were young, but I think, I think you're the one who has the more talent as a trainer. It's frustrating, I've never felt this way before. It, it, is this what makes it fun or to raise Pokemon? Whatever it is, I, I know I don't want to lose again. It's weird. It's weird to even ask, but let me go on ahead first. Okay. Alright, uh, whatever. Alright, what do you have to say, Pikachu? Look at that. Pikachu gave Trace a look as he, uh, <laughs> he wants to battle again soon. Okay. So, that is pretty much it right there, guys. In our next episode, whoa, nearly got that. In our next episode, we will be going straight to the Pokemon League and battling everybody. Going into the uh, Victory Road and then going into the Pokemon League. In the meantime, off screen, I will be capturing some different Pokemon, leveling up this whole team right here. I kind of want to get them all to level 60. It's not that hard. We just need to capture some different Pokemon, but it's going to be there soon. So thank you guys again for watching. I will see you guys next time.